Hello everyone, welcome back to the DVD review where today we are looking at the Catch Me If You Can, a Steven Spielberg classic from 2002, around the time where the movies weren't getting that classic. It's a classic to me. Uh, so this movie features Leonardo DiCaprio and Tom Hanks, if you couldn't tell from the cover. So it's, uh, yeah, so there's the price, there's the rating, rated 12 for nothing apparently. This is uh, <laughs> sorry. This movie is rated twelve for nothing. Apparently, it's just rated twelve because oh, I don't know. It just is inspired by the extraordinary true story of, of a brilliant young master of deception and the FBI agent hot on his trail. Catch me if you can. There's Oscar asterisk nominee Leonardo DiCaprio and two-time Academy Academy Award asterisk asterisk winner Tom Hanks in one of the year's most acclaimed hits. From three-time Oscar actress, 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 where director Steven Spielberg, Catch Me If You Can, follows Frank W. Abagnale Jr. as he successfully passes himself as a pilot, a lawyer, and a doctor, all before his twenty-first birthday. The film becomes very this comes very highly recommended. Jonathan Ross, film two thousand three. Going ahead of the ride, says the Empire. Don't listen to these; just form your own opinion. That's how I learned. Uh, oh look, the asterisks, they actually make sense. Best supporting actor nomination, uh, what's eating Gilbert Grave? This was before you know Leonardo DiCaprio got any awards for his movies. His first uh movie award act for acting was uh acting in uh, The Revenant, even though everyone said it was for Walter Wall Street, but there we go. Uh, best actor for us, going best actor. Uh, Philadelphia for Tom Hanks, and then Best Director, Seven Proper, Best Director, Shane Lewis, and Best Director, Best Picture, Shane Lewis. Uh, subtitles, languages, still rated 12 or nothing. This is a 2004 DVD release. It's 2 hours 15 minutes. It's in color because, of course, it is. Uh, this is this. Yeah, what, what the hell is this? It's like sort of meshing with the white. Of, that doesn't make any sense. Uh, so, this is the DVD disc itself. Uh, that's definitely uh, an age rating. Uh, the old German rating. It's a number surrounded by more words and letters and stuff. Yeah. So this uh, DVD cost two fifty. I also got from CEX. There's two other ones, three other ones from CEX in my new batch that there's left to get to. Actually, there's a few. I, I don't know. There's, there's just a few. So I hope, yeah. So I hope you enjoyed this quick TV review. What I think of the film itself, it's a good movie. Nothing spectacular, but I do think it's a very good movie. I think I give it like a seven point five, or it wasn't an eight. I don't know. It but bottom line, it was a well made movie by a well made director who makes some of the greatest movies of all time that I haven't seen yet because I'm not old enough to watch them. God, I wish I was old enough to watch Sooner's List and Save Private Ryan. But uh, I do have Jaws, so that's uh, and I also have E. T. Yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this uh, quick DVD review. Uh, not really quick anymore. It's three and a half minutes. Make sure you like and subscribe to this video. And goodbye.